Bismillahirrahmanirrahim in the name of Allah the most very peace and the most merciful guys as I already told you that I'm solving the past paper AP Calcula 2018 and I already solved question number one to question number 20 now we are going to move question number 21 which is based on partial fraction right a partial fraction in calculus is very important chapters and it will give you five or six questions in AP so please be strong in uh, partial fraction I'm going to solve this question and here I'm going to tell you the detail of the partial fraction right okay so as you can see here we have a uh, integration of 6x squared minus 4x minus 25 divided by x minus 2 right remember one thing in your mind if the numerator is a quadratic equation and the denominator is a linear equation right for example a linear factor uh, if the if the degree of numerator if the degree of numerator is greater than the degree of what the denominator then do one thing uh, the numerator is going to divide by the denominator right until uh, you can see the equal uh, degree or the degree of denominator is less than uh, is greater than the degree of numerator okay so again I am going to tell you if you find the degree of numerator is greater than the degree of uh, denominator then you have to divide numerator by denominator right so I am going to solve this question right okay so what we have to do I'm going I, I, I can see here we can see the degree of x squared here the degree of x squared means is 2 here right if you see the numerator you will find the quadratic equation and the degree is 2 and here we have degree 1 right so what will I do I'm going to divide uh, 6x squared minus 4x uh, minus 25 and I'm going to divide this by x minus 2. Okay, by remainder theorem. So, how will I divide this one? Uh, you have to take the first term here. What is the first term here? 6x squared, right? So, 6x is, six is squared. And I'm going to divide by this first term, right? Means 6x squared divided by x. So, the answer will be x, x cancel. You have what? 6x. Uh, then just write down 6x here right and then 6x is going to multiply by x so the answer will be what 6x squared right and then 6x multiplied by minus 2 it will be what minus 12x right then you have to change the sign so that we can just cancel out so this will be minus and this will be plus right so you can see this one this one cancel now plus 12x minus 4x it will be 8x and this is what minus 25 right again you have to do the same process so now we have what 8x okay so just write down 8x and divided by the first term of the denominator which is x so x x cancel now you have 8 you can say this will be plus 8 right okay now again uh, by 8 I am going to multiply by x it will be at x and 8 multiplied by minus 2 it will be 16 again change the sign so if this is what positive it will be negative and this is negative it will be half so this one cancel out uh, minus 25 right so minus 25 plus 16 is minus 9 now we can say uh, six, uh, this one <coughs> 6 this equation is uh, uh, this one we can say 6x plus 8 okay this is your question this can be written as this minus 9 divided by what x minus 2 right this is you can say is equal to this one right so I'm going to write and this with pen so 6x squared minus 4x minus 25 divided by x minus 2 uh, with the help of the partial fraction, we can break any rational function into two terms, right? So I have done here. So if you multiply here, you will find this one is equal to this one, right? After then, we have to find the integration of that. So I'm going to integrate on both sides. Like this one, okay? Dx. This one, dx, right? Okay. Now you can just open. So you can say integration of what? 6x dx plus integration of a dx minus 9 is out integration of what x minus 2 dx okay 
Okay, so here 6 is out, and integration of x is what? x squared by 2, and here we have e, and integration of dx is x minus m, and 1 divided by x minus 2, which will be what? ln x minus 2. Okay, so we can say 6 divided by 2 is 3x squared plus 8x minus 9 ln x minus 2 in mod plus c. This is the final answer of this question. So if, if you can see here with a 3x squared plus 8x minus 9 ln x minus 2 plus c. So this is the way to solve this question. Okay, and please watch my next video because there I'm going to solve question number 22. I hope guys you all understand. Please take care. Assalamu alaikum.